Othala. Othala is the final rune of the final eight in the Elder Futhark and makes the O sound as in box. Its general meanings deal with physical and familial inheritance, tradition, and steadfastness. The rune reversed indicates rebellion, loneliness, and separation. Othala is a strong and positive rune which represents your connection to your family, however you define it. The saying, you are the sum of everyone you've met until this moment, is a good way of expressing how Othala shows up in your life beyond the boundaries of blood. Those connections can manifest in your life in physical, cultural, and social ways. Physically, Othala represents the material things you've received from your elders, everything from your grandfather's watch to your mother's eye color. These things are important reminders, connections to those who went before you that ground you and show you who you are as a person. Culturally, this rune helps you understand who you are in a broader sense. In essence, Othala is pointing out all the traditions you uphold from those who went before you. Some traditions are positive. Sunday afternoon dinners with friends and family, ways of celebrating the holidays, and naming traditions. Othala, though, can also indicate traditions which aren't so positive, such as a parent's hair-trigger temper or bigoted attitudes towards others. Here the rune is challenging you to view all the culture you've inherited and separate the gold from the dross. If a tradition is unworthy, don't pass it on. Another association for Othala has to do with persistence and patience. Modern life gives us a lot of obstacles and challenges to overcome, and being discouraged is a common state when we're faced with the onslaught of choices. View Othala as an indicator that you should take the long view. Solutions to your problems are rarely easy to come by, nor are they quick to appear. Here the rune is telling you to be patient, take your time, and trust that those solutions will come, up, come about at the right time. Drawing with all the reverse generally means that something or someone has disconnected you from your support system. Without support of some kind, we as humans tend to drift down into a feeling of helplessness and hopelessness, and emerging from that deep well of despair is a Herculean task. At those times, it's important to be courageous and ask for help. Finding that courage can itself be a chore, but Othala reversed is a reminder that you have to do it, or else you'll be mired down, unable to move up and out of your current situation. Another interpretation for Othala reversed is rebellion, a full-on rejection of your current situation. Here the rune is indicating that the problem you're facing has put you in an untenable situation. You can't possibly survive, and your only solution is to break free from your past habits and choices. Without this complete break, you're slowly destroying yourself. Three Rune Spread For those who use the Three Rune Spread, where the first rune represents the objective, the second opposition, and the third outcome, Othala reveals the following. As an objective, following in the footsteps of others will be important. Be aware of what's been tried before. In opposition, remember guidelines, not rules. Don't let tradition dictate every move you make. And as an outcome, don't hide your solutions away so that only you benefit from them. Share them. For those who use the kindred spread, seeking messages from the gods, ancestors, and nature spirits, Othala communicates the following. From the gods, live your beliefs. Talking about them is not enough. From the ancestors, honor the wisdom of the ancients and strive to be remembered well yourself. And from the nature spirits, create a world that your ancestors would be proud of and that your progeny can live in. And finally, focus on Othala when you need to reconnect with your loved ones, their traditions, and their wisdom. Keep in mind that you are a link in the chain, and someday your traditions will be remembered by others act accordingly.